So usually when I sing a song on this channel, I do my best to make it so that it makes sense for the character to be singing it. I know this isn't necessarily complicated, but basically, because I have the one guy on my channel who sings the songs, I like to make it so that it makes sense that he's the one singing. And even last year when I sang 5,000 Candles in the Wind, I still kind of made it fit the narrative. It still made sense for this character to be singing it. This song, I can't really do that. And I, just because all the singing guy stuff is still currently in Bowling Green. This song is so incredibly obviously from the musical that it's from that there's no way that I can spin it to make sense for the universe of my channel. And I also very much acknowledge that you didn't need this caveat, but I wanted to give it anyway. So, with that unnecessary caveat out of the way, I hope you all enjoy this performance of Another Terrible Day from The Lightning Thief, the Percy Jackson musical. Oh, you're alive, I suppose. That's good news for you, but it means a lot more paperwork for me. So don't expect me to be happy to see you. Of course, being alive is temporary. So, maybe if I go away and play Pinochle for a few hours, things might improve. For me, not for you. You'll be dead. Where am I? Great, you haven't been debriefed. This is way out of my pay grade, which you say in a lot, cause I don't get paid. Someone find Professor Hay for breath and tell him Peter Johnson's away, so I better clip flop over here. It's Percy Jackson. Whatever. Just another terrible day. I camp half blood where everything's the worst. Just another terrible day. When you're in charge, it's like you're cursed. Well, technically I am cursed. One romp in the woods with Zeus's favorite wood nymph, and you're stuck running a summer camp for a bunch of needy half-bloods. Half-blood? Yeah, half-god, half-mortal. Does no one watch the orientation film? Did you say half-god? Yeah, and I half-care. Who's next? Selena Beauregard? <laughs> oh, great, she's crying. I was walking in the strawberry fields with Charlie Beckendorf, and we were holding hands, and everything was totally normal. And then I kissed him, and all of a sudden, he started growing sunflowers everywhere. Look, kid, I hate to be the one to tell you, but I think that Charlie Beckendorf was also holding hands with a nymph who doesn't want to wish you well. To tell you the truth, the best thing is to break up with the guy. Of course, who am I to give relationship advice? I'm literally the god of alcohol. But he loves me. He loves you not. Next! Another terrible day. I camp half blood where everything's the worst. Just another terrible day. I'm the god of wine and I'm dying of thirst. Wait, did you say that you're a god? Dionysus, god of wine. The gods are really yippee skippy. Ah, Katie Gardner, I see you've injured your arm. I fell off a pegasus. You don't have flying lessons on Thursday. You have archery. Those arrows are made of wood. Wood comes from trees. I refuse to participate in any activity that encourages the senseless slaughter of our arboreal friends. Oh, gods, give me Aries or Apollo. Anyone but the Demeter Kid's cabin. Now that you've blessed us, go talk to Hephaestus before I take a knife to my head and start stabbing. And stay away from the Pegasi. Girls and ponies. Ah, speaking of ponies. Percy. Mr. Brunner, what are you doing here? This guy is saying all this crazy stuff about nymphs and gods. What is going on? It's complicated. Oh, kid, you have no idea about this place or your former mentor. I don't have time to fill you in on the details. But look, he's also a centaur. God. <laughs> I didn't mean to tell you. Another terrible Mr. day. Brother. I can't We're have blood horse. where everything's the worst. Just another terrible what day. You can hate it here, but I hated it first. Another terrible day. Stuck with these runs in the muck and mud Another terrible day Oh God! I need a drink Enjoy your stay at Camp Half-Blood